Welcome to Toffee TV. It is the Everton News Daily. Everton goalkeeper Robin Olsen has admitted he wants more game time at Goodison Park after making his debut against Newcastle uh, last month, or earlier this month rather. Um, Olsen said that he has spoken to Carlo Ancelotti and that there is a plan in place. He said, there's a plan. I had a chat with Mr Ancelotti after I signed. It takes time to settle in a new country and move club. And it was great to make my debut at Newcastle, but now I want to play more and I'm going to work hard to ensure that I will do. Uh, he had the one game in a defeat at Newcastle and then Jordan Pickford come back into the side against Manchester United and kept his place in the 3-2 win of Fulham at the weekend. Ancelotti did speak about potentially rotating goalkeepers this season, so it seems that Robin Olsen is desperate to get more game time and a lot of Evertonians would like to see him play more as well. So it's a, a real challenge to Jordan Pickford to try to keep Olsen out of the side. And I guess the more goals Everton concede, and they're conceding quite a lot at the minute, the more opportunity Olsen will get to stake his claim in the Everton side. Uh, Everton again today linked with Villarreal winger Samuel Chukwiz. Um, the 21-year-old winger who came off the bench at the weekend won a penalty for Villarreal has been linked with Everton continually over the last month or so. Um, Villarreal boss Unai Emery has admitted that uh, Chuck Weezy may leave for another league. said, we're very, very pleased with him and what he's doing at the moment. He's an excellent player, but it is true. He may leave the club and go to another league. So it's very interesting. He's also been linked, of course, I've seen his name linked with Arsenal, Liverpool, United, Real Madrid. But Everton have been one that have been there for a while. Although some of the fees that they're asking, you know, seen reports of £70 million and stuff like that, not going to happen. But he's under contract at Villarreal until 2023. So see what happens there. But he is a good player, very quick. Uh, Everton are going to offer uh, young left-back Thierry Small a new deal to ward off interest from Bayern Munich and Juventus. That story is doing the rounds today. The young left-back scored at the weekend in a 3-0 victory. He scored two at Burnley as well earlier this season. He's a big prospect for Everton. Uh, he's doing really well. He's been at Everton since the age of 11 when he joined from West Bromwich Albion's academy. And it seems Everton want to tie him down to a longer and uh, more generous deal is what's being said today. So let's see what happens there. And an interesting link today, Everton linked with a trio of Spurs players. Um, Deli Ali, Harry Winks and Paolo Gazaniga are the latest to be thought to be on Marcel Brands' wish list, which seems a bit mad to me. I guess as we move forward now, we're, we're coming towards the end of November and into December and it's the mad month then as January is uh, just around the corner, the January transfer window then, isn't it? So I, th I guess Everton will continue to be linked with players like this. But, you know, Marcel Brands doesn't really do deals in January. Obviously, we had Jared Branthwaite last January. That was the only player we brought in. But uh, Carlo Ancelotti thought to want a couple of reinforcements in January, especially if there's an opportunity for Everton to push for Europe. But this one, the Spurs trio, I just can't see that happening whatsoever. That is it. Make sure you subscribe, give the video a thumbs up. And if you want more videos, join us on Patreon. See you later.